Hi guys and welcome to 123's tutorial on how to set up a, um, a hotspot, 3G hotspot on your iPhone 4S. Uh, now, uh, what, why would you actually want to do this? So you might want to share the internet connection uh, from your iPhone. Um, you should get like a monthly monthly uh, download allowance, let's say you know, 1, 1.5 gig, maybe more than that, maybe 4 gig, 10 gig. Uh, depends what type of plan you're on, and with that you can download, um, use all the downloads from your from your iPhone, from your Safari or your your Mail. However, you can also share that with your PCs, and uh, this is uh, basically shows you a step by step on how to how to set up a personal hotspot um, for your PC and share it through your PC. Okay, so if you go into settings, and then you have personal. You may have personal hotspot already here. This one here. However, if you don't, you might need to go down to general, and then go into cellular. All right, and then go down to personal hotspot. Now, if this is this may be already off by default, and you have to actually go in here and turn it on. Okay, this is what comes up here, and it says a personal hotspot will only be available over USB. Do you also want to enable over Wi-Fi and Bluetooth? You can just go turn on Wi-Fi and Bluetooth. Okay, so they're both turned on now. So what that means is that you can actually share it either via the Bluetooth to your machine, via Wi-Fi to your machine, or via the USB. You can share the connection with your phone. What I probably recommend is. Um, to share it via Wi-Fi, but make sure you have your phone plugged in and turn it and plug it into a power source when you when you're doing this. And if you put your phone up as high as you can, that will give you a good signal with the with the 3G network and also a good signal to your to your Wi-Fi to your PC. All right. So once that's turned on, we just go back to cellular, back to general again, back into settings, and then once you've turned it on, you should have this personal hotspot come up here. Okay. You click on Wi-Fi password. So this puts a password in when you want to join up via your Wi-Fi. So I'm just going to change or add in that password there. One two three. My IT. And it needs to be eight characters in length. So um, I'll put in an, uh, an extra one after that. All right. And then just press done. Okay, so now your Wi-Fi hotspot should be set up. Um, and I just tested on my machine here to show you guys. Okay, if we go down the bottom here, you can see the Wi-Fi phone is already connected. I'll just disconnect that and hit connect again. Now it's already connecting straight away because we, um, because I just I just connected this recently. So what I'm going to do is open up our network settings, manage the wireless networks, and I'm just going to delete our iPhone profile. And what this will do, this will actually force us to to use a password. Right, so if we start that up again, might just have to unplug it because it's plugged in via USB to the PC. So if I unplug that now, it should uh, it should give us a blank page with any luck. There we go. Okay. So as you can see there now, the blank page. So we can't actually browse to anything. Okay, so as you can see there, we've got the Internet Explorer web page, which still can't browse. So if we go down the bottom, click on iPhone, connect automatically, put in the password, 123 myit1. We'll see if that will connect now. Okay, so as you can see, it's connected. On your iPhone too, it will come up at the top here, it will say personal hotspot one connection at the top. Okay, 
So that means that the PC is now connected. If you look back down here, connected to the iPhone, and if we try web browsing now, we should have a connection there. All right, and we've got the Google page. Okay, guys, so that's pretty much it on how to connect it via Wi-Fi. Like I said, um, if you're going to do this connection, make sure that you have your phone up high um, to get a good 3G connection. As you can see, mine's only got two bars there, so it probably wouldn't give me very good um, internet connection on where it is at the moment. Um, what I would suggest is put it up high, make sure it's plugged into the wall socket with power, and that should uh, enable you to get a better connection there. All right. Thanks for watching the video guys um, and stay tuned for more videos later on. Bye bye.